had about 10 participants, so undergraduate native students, grad students, we might have even had a, a recent graduate and a postdoc, and they looked at a soil microbiome of an indigenous controlled site. And they focused on the disturbances at that site, they did some comparisons with undisturbed sites, and what we really want our participants to look at and see is how settlement not only changed the human landscape, but it also changed the soil, it's changed the natural landscape, uh, and it therefore it changed the relationships between humans and non-humans. And what we generally see is landscapes of settlement, monocrops, uh, industrialized pollution. Obviously, they're much sicker than landscapes such as native prairie grasslands. So we've had some first and second years come into the lab for the first time and learn basic skills, but they're learning from indigenous scientists who are older than them and more senior than them. And that shows them that they can have a place in science, a place that they never thought they could have, because we as indigenous people don't see our own people as role models in the laboratory. All of our participants, junior or senior, will participate in doing publications out of the summer research program, because all nations live governed by science in a contemporary world. Indigenous peoples as nations are no different. And so we also want to engage what people think of as quote unquote Western science.